Let's take a look at our Sports 411 update. Here's the sportsman, Stephen Koo Francis. Thanks a lot, Jerome. I'm here with St. Croix Track Club with Coach Smith and Nymphor Bernard, track star, and she's heading off to college. Um, but before we go, she go to college. We just want to catch up with her and find out what she's been up to and talk about, uh, about the St. Croix Track Club. Coach Smith, um, first of all, I want to thank you for bringing your, your, your club here. I appreciate it. Thank you very much for having us. We uh, want to first give thanks to God Almighty for us. Uh, for what he has done to us and with us in terms of helping her get a scholarship to go to school, a full scholarship that is, and so we just say thank you. Okay, yes, yeah, some good news, man, Miss Bernard. Tell tell the folks up about um, the college you you're going to and uh, about the scholarship, man. Well, I have a full scholarship to go to the University of Arkansas, and I will be going um, on Saturday. Okay. And we start training on Monday. All right, man. That's good. Some real good news, Coach. And how did she come about this? Um, it's, uh, I would have to highlight and give thanks to all our sponsors. I mean, I can I have a little list here that I need to read. Yeah, <laughs> but, um, you know, Thomas Bakery, Frederickstead and Christianstead, First Bank, Hovensa, Advanced Radiology, PHC, which is a professional holding company, VI Paving, Williams Chiropractic Clinic, Jackie's Beauty Supply, Rams Auto Repair, St. Croix Gas, Bankers of St. Croix, Gallows Bay Hardway, and Carib Home Center. We, with these sponsors, we were able to take her to Puerto Rico and Totola and have her compete at high-level competitions so she can actually qualify for races like Carifta. And while at Carifta, a coach saw her and was interested in her. And so it's really to highlight the perseverance that she ex exhibited over the last three years in being in practice every day, day in, day out, you know, when practice was called, and also having great uh, academics. Good grades is a must in order to get uh, a student a, a scholarship. Okay, uh, Mr. Bernard, I know you, you seem very excited about leaving on Saturday and, and representing and doing good over there in the college. Yes, I just want to go and improve my times and do the best I can in track and field and in school. Okay, man, that sounds good. Coach, um, keep up the good job. I see we have some youngsters behind there. So you, you, you still, you're still grooming? Yes, we're still grooming. We um, believe that you, know, you have to start with them young and teach them how to run and teach them some discipline and all the things that come along with track and field in terms of life lessons. And so once they keep the grade up and they continue to do something in track and field because there are so many different events, they should get a scholarship like Ninfa as well. I want to encourage all the people out there to remember that Having good grades is the first step towards getting a, a full scholarship, but um, doing some type of curricular, extracurricular activity as in track and field, baseball, whatever, you can then get a, a scholarship and be able to you know, ease your parents' burden of um, you know, college tuition and room and board and so forth. Okay, before we go, um, any words of advice to anyone your age or anyone younger than you? Yeah. Well, I'll just advise them to keep um, trying, keep doing what they're doing. Even though you're not the best now, keep trying, keep with it, and someday you might be the best. All right, Coach, thanks a lot, and thanks a lot for the St. Croix Track Thank Club. And uh, Ms. Bernard, we wish you the best. And positive news, man, here on News Channel 8. That's a look at your sports 401 update. I'm Stephen Koo Francis, the News Channel 8. Back to you, Jerome. Thanks, Coop. And your weather forecast for tonight and tomorrow is coming up next on News Channel 8. Stay with us.